What is going on my locotes? It is your Vato Spike and I am back with a brand new video. Today's video is going to be 5 haunting ghost videos that are too scary to watch alone. Hopefully you guys are not alone either so that you guys will be able to watch this and not get too scared. Um, I always enjoy watching Nukes Top 5 even if they're not scary. They are very interesting but some of them are pretty scary. But thank you guys so much for all your love and support. If you haven't already, please hit that like button and that sub button. It really helps with the channel. It helps me grow in this YouTube world so that one day I can have the plaque up there for you guys to see. And it'll be because of you guys. Anyway guys, without any further ado, let's get right into the video. Top five ghosts caught on camera, followed home. Over on the YouTube channel Ashes to Ashes, Dave and his brother Chris explore abandoned and sometimes supposedly haunted houses. In this investigation of a woman who says that she has been haunted by an evil entity that has followed her for most of her life, the guys pick up a very strange EVP. Who's here? Got busy. You too? Yep. Is there anything that would like to uh Is there anything that would like to uh Is there anything that would like to uh I'm gonna ask you to give us a sign up here. A creepy little voice seems to say, go with him. And Dave says that he thinks the evil entity in the house might have done just that. Since the investigation, he's heard sounds and voices in his home, especially in one particular hallway. And then, one day, his dog begins to act very strange. Who is it? Who's down there? I'll show you that there's nobody in the hall. Did you see it? I'll show you that there's nobody. That could be anything, though. Um, yeah, that looks like it could be anything. He didn't like go back to where it's going. In the hall. Wait. But I saw a little piece of it, though. Look. Show you that there's nobody in the hall. Look, look, look. Oh, damn. I could be wrong, actually. Who is it? Some odd thing with pointy ears seems to be hiding around the edge of a door. And note that when Dave swings his camera back around, whatever it was, is now gone. You can watch all of Ashes to Ashes Paranormal Investigations over on their YouTube channel. First ghost hunt, last ghost hunt. Reddit user Manda Burke and her husband were exploring the haunted Hillview Manor, an old mental asylum located in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. They had bought tickets as part of a ghost hunting tour group. Manda says they walked around, checked the EVP meters supplied by the tour company, but nothing much happened. Then they began to hear an odd shuffling sound at the end of one of the halls, but they thought nothing of it at the time. Then. Suddenly, from the end of the hall, they heard running footsteps charging towards them. <laughs> this dude is terrified. Well, him too, but he's right there like, he's tight. <laughs> Amanda says that the whole event was one of the scariest things she's ever experienced. Now I should note that I don't usually show videos without some visible or audible evidence of the supernatural. But looking at the reaction of this group 
and seeing just how hard and painful those falls look, I think this is pretty compelling evidence that something came down that hall. But as always, you decide. A new roommate. A viewer from the Czech Republic named Simon says that he had never experienced anything supernatural in his apartment. That is, until a few months ago when his girlfriend Barra moved in with him. He says that after she moved in, strange things suddenly began to <laughs> so, he, so he's blaming her for bringing a spirit into his house. <laughs> ...to occur in his home. Small objects seemed to move on their own, and he would often hear strange noises like taps or footsteps. One night, he starts recording after hearing an unexplained sound. Co? Hej, co? A kde byly ty nůžky? Oh, the ghost might be jealous. He might hate the girl. Oh, okay, 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 okay. He might be jealous. He wants to kill her. Might be a girl. Udělej to! Ve jménu Otce i Syna i Ducha Svatého, ve jménu Otce i Syna i Ducha Svatého. Oh. After these strange events, the next night Simon decides to leave a camera recording the entire room. And he catches this. So is Simon's apartment haunted? Did the spirit somehow follow when his girlfriend moved in? Or is it just an elaborate hoax? I doubt it. I feel like probably um, the ghost could be a female because that shadow did look female-like and she got pissed off that his girlfriend moved in. And maybe <laughs> she wants to, because think about it, he's clapping that every night now and the ghost has to see that. I bet you she is pissed. You decide. The Watts House. The strange events at the Watts family home in Colorado might be one of the most reliably documented hauntings of all time. Because every piece of paranormal evidence comes directly from footage recorded by policemen on their body cams. Rutgers Police Department, anybody in the house, make yourself known! Shannon Watts and her daughters, Bella and Cece, lost their lives under absolutely horrible circumstances all at the hands of husband and father, Chris Watts. In fact, the details of the case are so grim that I'm not going to go into them here. But if you want to read the full story, you can simply Google the Watts family. 
In this video, two female officers from the police canine unit go to the Watts house to investigate. Oh, you know what? Nukes Top 5 does um, re-put old videos back. So I might have reacted to this one already. I feel like I did to where um, she goes into a room and here's um, the mom and the girl. The strange disappearance. Obviously, this video was recorded before the tragic fate of Shannon. But yeah, Nukes Top 5 did that to the last video I reacted to. One part I have already reacted to in this old video. And, and her children were known. This footage is 100% real. It is documented police video captured by one of the investigator's body camera. So shortly after entering the house, they catch some strange video on the stairs. Many viewers believe that this looks like a quick glimpse of a childlike apparition descending the stairs. But it could just be a video glitch. You decide. Oh, no. But then the policewoman begins to catch multiple strange and unusually clear EVPs on her body cam. So there's your attic access right there. And I think the bo both the ladies um, hear it too. So there's your attic access right there. But strangest of all, while investigating an upstairs closet, uh. the investigators hear something that actually seems to spook them. The unexplained voice of a giggling child can be heard, but there's absolutely no explanation for where the sound came from. The canine officer is so spooked she asks the other officer to check it out. Oh my gosh. What in the world is that? Wow. Let's go in there and step on that little blue thing and see if that's where that voice came from. Yeah, it sounded like a kid toy. <laughs> it might. It sort of sounded like it. Something. There was a... I heard it. Did you hear it? I did. It sounded like a kid giggling or something, didn't it? Or a kid... It did. That was strange, but we're making note of that. I, I heard it. I definitely heard the same thing you did. Yeah, and then he just sort of turned around. What? The story gets even stranger. One month after the tragic incident, police are called back to the empty house because neighbors report seeing a woman moving around inside the home. Also, someone had turned on the inside garage lights. The police found no one inside. Oh, you know what? I didn't see this part. This, this is new. But some viewers believe that they might have caught something else. As a police officer is standing at the top of the stairs, it almost looks as if some small shadow peeks out from behind him, just for a second. So is the Watts house haunted by the spirits of Shannon and her daughters? Or are these simply tricks of the light and random noises? What do you think? Anyway, thanks for watching. If you see a video any you know, this one was interesting. Um, damn, I almost had myself right there. This one was interesting. Um, I did. I do remember this last one. I have reacted to it before in one of the old videos. But Nukes Top Five does forget. He goes through a lot of videos, and obviously, um, every once in a while, I'm pretty sure he would put in an accidental one again. But anyways, you guys, hope you guys did enjoy. I did enjoy this one. This one was very interesting. I did like it. Hope you guys did too. Um, I know some of them are not as scary as the other ones, but. I always do enjoy a news, uh, news top five video. Anyways, you guys, thank you guys so much for all your love and support. If you haven't already, please hit that like button and that sub button. It really helps with the channel, helps me grow on this YouTube world so that one day I can get a plaque, put it up there, it'll be whatever for whatever number, and then it'll hit to a million, then five million, 30 million. You know how it is. Anyways, you guys, I uh, hope you guys have a good rest of your day. You guys already know how it is. There's bad people, it goes scary, uh, scary stuff, scary creatures, always trying to go after you. So, without. <laughs> Anyway, anyways, you guys, you already know how it is. There's creatures, ghosts, scary people always trying to hurt you. So in that case, keep through trying to really hope to see you guys in the next video.